Okay, so since everyone literally requested this today, we're gonna be talking about the Russian sleep experiment. So in the height of World War II, Russian scientists wanted to find a way to keep their soldiers awake longer. And in order to do this, they decided to test the effects of extreme sleep deprivation. They rounded up five prisoners of war and were like, hey, if you do this, we'll grant you your freedom. So they put them all inside of this sealed glass chamber that would continue to release this stimulant gas that would keep them awake. And apparently this gas was still in the experimental stages, so they didn't really know what would happen with it. But they were pretty confident that it wouldn't kill them at the least. So they begin, and the first three to four days goes pretty great. Everyone's overall pretty optimistic. Pumping the gas, the prisoners are staying awake. But day four is when they started to see a pretty big change in their subjects. The subjects went from small talk to talking about really dark things like their traumas. They started to complain about the experiment as well. And on day six, the participants actually stopped talking to each other entirely and even got paranoid. Each of them segregated themselves off in their own section of the chamber. A few of them began to believe that they could sell out their comrades in order to get out of the experiment. They tried to get each other in trouble, but the researchers didn't care. They were just there to observe. But on day nine, things took a significant turn whenever one of them just started screaming and running around. But back and forth across the chamber for about two to three hours until he was just making a squeaking noise. And it was later found out that he had actually torn his own vocal cords from screaming so much. And the other subjects did not react to this whatsoever. Instead, the other participants reacted by ripping out parts of the books that were given to them to entertain them during this experiment. They soaked them in toilet water and started to place them over the glass so that the researchers could no longer see in. And you're going to be shocked by what happens next.